So I have these speakers. And when I first got them, they both were working fine. Not much connectivity issues or anything like that. The reviews, a lot of them had said that there was problems where the left one would stop working. And when I first got it, I had no complaints, but yeah, now it's not working. So what I'm gonna do is I went online and it says that if you tap it three or five times and hold it for 20 seconds, it'll reset the reset them and you'll be able to um, to repair them again and, and they'll both be working. But I'm gonna show you right now that that is not the case. How many times is that? Let me try it again. One, two, three. Let's try that one first. Blinking. So I believe that means that it's reset. Blink. Blink, it blunked? <laughs> As you can see, this other one's not on. Oh, there it goes. Wait a minute. Watch, now that I pulled out the camera. So I'm gonna try connect this to my phone here. And these are auto connect. There's a magnet on the back of these. So what I usually do is I'll just swing these around. I don't know if there's an order. If there is, and that's pretty stupid, but I'm gonna tell you right now that I'm not buying another pair of these JBLs. Yeah, see, the one light turned on. Okay, that's actually better progress. Let me see. Go to my settings here. Heyday speaker? No. Yeah, this happened last time too. Took forever to find it. Here they are. Okay, so I'm gonna delete, forget this device, delete it. So let's try this again. Okay. You know what? Bluetooth off. 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 Let's go back. Go back, go back, go back. Uh, I'm gonna go, I don't even see the one is on. They should probably be both be on, but let's turn the Bluetooth on here first. Okay, nothing's connected. And let's pull these both out at the same time. And just for fairness, see, nope, oh, there it goes. Second one, JBL Endurance Peak. Let's connect to you. Let's go to YouTube, let's see. It fucking works. <laughs> It hasn't been working for weeks. Um, I do have to say that me personally, this is like my fourth or fifth set of um, Bluetooth headphones. And I have to say that uh, I, I wouldn't, I don't even want to keep these. I'll keep using them as backups, but I'm not happy with them at all. Especially that I had to go through all of this and I've been using them for maybe about a week or two, maybe longer. Uh, with just the one headphone. Yeah, I won't be buying another pair of these JBLs. The sound quality, yeah, it's all right. It's a little louder than any of the, anything under 75 bucks, 50 bucks. There's no bass in it. There's no, it's, it's just lacking sound wise. And with this Bluetooth issue, it, it's just not worth the money. Maybe 30 bucks, you get a cool case. But other than that, I, I, I won't be buying another set of these. I gotta rate these like a one out of five, do not recommend. All right, so a little update. You know, ever since the last video I shot about these, um, they started working again. Of course they would. So I was like, I decided uh, I'm gonna take them with me on a trip. I took them, you know, the, full, the light shows that it's fully charged, this and that, and I'm thinking, cool. I go and try to start them up and pair them with my phone, and guess what happens? The right side headphone, the one that controls everything, took a crap on me and it doesn't charge anymore. Let me see if I could show you. You're gonna have to take my word for it. There it goes. Yeah, you see that? The, only the right side or left side ear earbud lights up showing that it's the only one that's charging. This one, nothing. So yeah, once again, just to hammer it home, these headphones are not, are not worth the money or the trouble. That's all, thank you.